Hey Megan, so um, I was looking at your assignment and I'm trying to I was trying to think of a good way to write a comment about it, but it's almost impossible to write a good comment to explain what went wrong because it's not big stuff, it's just little stuff that happens. So I wanted to show you kind of where things went badly uh, on these questions. So on this one you've got negative 4 times negative 8. Don't put minus 32 there, I think that's just confusing. Instead of bringing down the minus automatically, just treat it like it's negative 4 times negative 8. Then you'd end up with negative 20 is equal to negative 4n plus 32. And then you would subtract 32. That's where the problem happened on this one. These would cancel and you end up with negative 52. And you just bring it down you'd end up with uh, divided by negative 4 and getting like a final answer of 13. So that's that one. It was just a problem with the distributive property and you sort of confusing yourself. For this one, um, negative 2 equals 2 plus v over 2. I'm happy with the fact that you did subtract 2 there. That's correct. The problem is negative 2 minus 2 is negative 4. It's like you borrowed $2 and you already owed 2, so now you're $4 in the hole. And then you do times 2, of course, and you end up with a negative 8. So that's the problem with that one. Number 10 is... Um, you did the wrong operation. Like you did the operation correct here, but then here it just it was gone. It's minus eight, so I want you to add eight. Now you see uh, there's a plus here. You need to look at this minus to see what to do. This uh, even though it says negative eight there, it's easier just to think of it. Once you see that the plus is there to show it's a plus minus relationship, treat it like it says minus eight. And then you'll add eight, and you'll end up with negative two. And you'll do times nine. And you'll end up with uh, negative. Uh, Sorry, I'm stupid. This is a 4. 4 times 2, which gives you, uh, 4 times negative 2 gives you negative 8. So that's how that goes. And then um, number 8, the issue is with, I'm trying to see. your answer. Negative, oh, I think you wrote 42 here as opposed to 72, so you should end up with uh, negative 12. Like, it's all the math right, except all of a sudden you did 42 divided by 6 as opposed to 72, so I think you just copied it down wrong or something. But uh, that's it, really. I mean, it's not huge things, it's just little things, but just be very careful uh, so you don't keep doing the same thing over and over again, because that's where the problems really happen. So, hopefully this